Dita Von Tees Clifferie's abuse is not the reason why she left Marilyn Manson. Death metal icon Marilyn Manson's life has long been a magnet for controversy, and in 2021, it took a turn for the worse when he was accused of sexual abuse. In February 2021, Westworld star Evan Rachel Wood claimed the rocker abused her in an Instagram post. The duo was in a relationship when Wood was 18, while the rock star was 36. He, Manson, started grooming me when I was a teenager and horrifically abused me for years. I was brainwashed and manipulated into submission. I am done living in fear of retaliation, slander, or blackmail," Wood noted in a lengthy statement. She added Manson took nude photos of her after giving her large amounts of drugs and alcohol and then used them to blackmail her in exchange for her silence. Following her post, several other women came forward with similar allegations. As news of all the allegations started gaining traction, fans were curious to know Manson's ex-wife, Dita Von Teese's opinions. Teese took to her Instagram and addressed the accusations against her former husband. The couple was married from 2005 to 2006, but the burlesque performer said the abuse was not why she left Manson. She clarified she had never been abused by the singer during their time together. She thanked everyone for expressing their concerns about her well-being before sharing that she could not relate to the other women, as her experience with Manson was different. Please know that the details made public do not match my personal experience during our seven years together as a couple. Had they, I would not have married him in December 2005. Tease. Dita Von Tease during her Glaminatrix in Paris. She then added that she left Manson after 12 months of marriage because of infidelity and drug abuse. Abuse of any kind has no place in any relationship. I urge those of you who have incurred abuse to heal and the strength to fully realize yourself. This would be the first and last time I would address this controversy, and I thank everyone for respecting my request. Tease and Manson first met when the latter cast the former in his music videos. They hit it off and stayed in touch even after filming the music video. One Vogue editor takes a look back at Marilyn Manson and Dita Von Teese's unconventional wedding ceremony, an event that made tradition look like a snore. The shock rocker invited the performer to his 32nd birthday party, and later in 2001, they started dating. They dated for several years before Manson proposed in 2004, with a vintage diamond engagement ring from the 1930s. After a year-long engagement, the pair tied the knot in 2005 in a lavish affair that stretched over several days across two countries. The pair first tied the knot at Dita's home in Los Angeles. But, according to reports, the couple did not have a church ceremony because of prejudices against Manson's reputation as a shock rocker. The couple also celebrated in Ireland at a Gothic-style mansion, Castle Gertine de la Poer in Tipperer. But just one year later, their marriage broke down. Tease explained she was not supportive of Manson's partying and his relationship with other women. She added that, something bad had happened, for her to leave him after six years together. But unfortunately, Tease did not reveal what it was and still has not.